This is the queue for Popeyes. This is the portrait of an absolutely defeated girl who just spent two hours in that queue for chicken. Was this ridiculously long queue worth it just for some chicken? I don't know anymore. So, Popeyes is one of my favorite chicken chains of all time. I actually tried it for the first time in Dubai a while ago and fell in love. I think it's incredible chicken. And they've just opened here at Westfield in Stratford in their food court area. There's Subway, there's other things as well. There's a McDonald's over there. But as you can see, the queue for Popeyes is the longest. There are so many people, like this is insanity. This isn't even the opening day. It's been open for a few days now. This is midweek, but already there's um, a lot of queue, like even now, even though it's like, uh, when I say it's a Tuesday today, so Tuesday, midweek, but yeah, very popular. And I understand why, because it's very, very good fried chicken. I have joined this massively long queue for Popeyes. It goes round and round. My estimation is that it's gonna take at least half an hour or so. Lord have genuine mercy. So I've been in this queue for exactly half an hour so far, and I'm only about halfway through the queue, I would say. Like, I've still got three more lanes to go, so I feel like we're gonna be in here for an hour. Also, welcome to the UK, the place in which nobody really bothers to wear masks anymore. Even when they're in crowded places like queues like this, without social distancing. One eternity later. So, I've been in the queue for over an hour so far. I think I've got another maybe 10, 15 minutes left to go. I have never queued this long for chicken, but I think it's worth it maybe for Popeyes? Probably not. We are at one hour and 17 minutes, close to 18 minutes. Still got a few people in front of me, but getting there. Slowly but surely getting there. I can smell the chicken finally. So they've now stopped the queue for a bit because there are too many orders that they're still preparing and cooking. So trying to kind of balance things out because there are, like I said, way too many orders waiting to be cooked still and there are people waiting for them and it can't have any more of them. It's, um, I've never experienced anything like this before. I feel like I'm a broken woman already. I've been in this queue for about an hour and 25 minutes by this point and I don't know why. I just don't understand anything about my life anymore. But I still want chicken. They have so many incredible things at Popeyes and one uh, UK specific item on the menu is the vegan burger which hopefully you should be able to see in a second over there. They haven't had uh, a vegan burger anywhere else apparently and they've bought a new vegan burger for Popeyes here in the UK. But also this apparently is also quite a, quite a new thing, the hot sauce thing. There you go, that's the vegan burger, the Crioli red bean sandwich. Is it actually time to order? Is it actually time to order now? Yeah. Oh my god, I'm excited. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I am. Do you want to oh. say hi? Okay. Come on then. Hello. Hi. These are the lovely people. <laughs> Popeyes. All right, so can I please get the chicken sandwich, please, as a meal? Um, yep. Spicy or? Um, regular, classic. Yeah. Um, what would you like? What size? What size would you say? Drink. Drink. Um, bottle of water, I think it's good. There's no bottle of drinks, no juices, only juicy drinks. Like Lord have genuine mercy. Um, it's because of, we've been so busy. I understand. Yeah, it's the first week as well. Oh, I don't like any fizzy drinks. I so, Coke, Diet Coke, Coke Zero, Fanta, Pepper Sprite. So, if I don't like any fizzy drinks, can I just have tap water? Um, you, uh, all, what I can do is I can put a fizzy drink and yeah. then ask me to request a tap water. Okay, one. sounds yeah. good, sounds good. I'll put Coke Zero for Okay, cool. Yeah. Um, then I will also have some uh, uh, spicy chicken wings. Wings, yeah. Yes. Five, eight, eight. Just the smallest one. Five, yeah. The onion rings, no, please. No, there's no onion rings. Uh, what have you got left on the side bit? Um, so we have mac and cheese, okay. mac and gravy. Have you got the biscuit? Yeah. Okay, can I uh, can I have actually can I have the yeah the biscuit please? Biscuit or the so with gravy. With gravy. Let's go with that. Yeah. Yeah yeah yeah. Why not? And then I also need the like, another meal for the chicken tenders please um, three, or five. three of them it's or mild, mild. Yeah. Um, that can I have with biscuit and um, gravy as well I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to, you're gonna have to ask them to change it around yeah, it's you're gonna add oh really okay yeah. that's fair enough Just that's okay not a problem and, and number two, number can I get a diet coke with this diet one food. yes please yeah. and and, um, also, a comes with that, but there's no ranch and there's no Louisiana hot dogs. Can I get them a uh, the, um, mustard one? Yeah. One mustard, yeah. Can I also get add a couple of garlic mayos? Just two garlic mayos extra for myself. Yeah. Can I get one three-piece chicken as well? Yeah, on its own. On its own, I think. Um, mild? Uh, 
Let's go mild, mild. And then, I think that's it. Uh, let's go for mac and cheese as well, why not? Thank you. And then, have, have, have we got any fries here at all? Just uh, one fry? There's fries in the chicken sandwich meal. Okay, sounds good. So we've got and two fries. if you want to um, double fries in the tenders meal, you can change it to something. Can I have one more fries actually? Yeah. Thank you, and I think that's it. Thank you. Actually, what we can do is we have the fries with both meals and then get some different sides. Alright, okay, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm sorry. Do you want to try mashing gravy? Yeah, let's go with that. Okay, thank you. I think that should be it. Plus, we're going to have the thing that's more than. Oh, yeah, can I get some more of the garlic mayo? Yeah. Thank you. We've got two garlic mayo. Do you want any other dip? Oh, what's a good one? What's a good one? Do you want to try the hot sauce? Yeah, why not? Yeah. Why not? Okay. I think that's it. That's it. Thank you so much. Okay, well, if you see me in the mirror there, I've got my order. Spent £32. By the way, my friend Rakaya is here as well. She's been waiting. She's She's got a table, she's been waiting for the past like two hours. I've been in this queue for the past hour and a half. It's a mess because she has to leave for work in like 10 minutes. So I'm gonna have to basically hand her the food. So this is not all for me, is what I'm trying to say. I'm gonna have to give her the food. One of the meals is for her. Um, but 30 pounds is still quite a lot for a fast food chain. But I'm excited because I'm not eating anything. Our order number is 1850. As you can see, it is getting prepared. It's being cooked right now. Nothing is ready though. So this is the thing. I feel like there's more stuff being prepared than things being handed into people. I hope you can appreciate the queue behind me, all the queue that I've done in the past hour and a half and still waiting because the food obviously hasn't arrived yet. Of all the things I thought I would do in my 31 years of life, queuing an hour and a half, 32 hours for chicken was not the one. Lord have mercy. So finally got the food. This is Rakaya. She's literally going to have to leave in like three minutes. But there is some food there. And I, you heard them. They don't even have tap, like bottled water. So I just asked for some tap water. I am a mess. I'm emotionally drained right now. Uh, I'm going to stop the timer. One hour, 39 minutes. <laughs> I, 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 I mean, I'm still hungry. I'm going to eat the food. I know it's phenomenal. I haven't had this meal in a long, long time. I love Popeye's chicken. I've never had the Popeye sandwich, though, so I'm excited to have that. I'm excited for Rukai to try it, even though she's only got like two minutes to try and eat everything. I'm going to stop this. I hate my life. Stop. I need a moment to understand what's going on, like what I've done with my life. Decisions that I've made voluntarily, spending an hour and a, over an hour and a half in a queue for Popeyes. I have a lot to say about it, just like the organization. Is it all right though? You've just had a little bite. Okay, good, good. I'll show you all the food in a bit, but right now I just need to remember why I even exist in this world and why I chose to spend two hours of it in that queue. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat some food now. So I got a lot. You probably saw everything that I ordered. There's a thigh here, thank the Lord. So I was like, ah, it's very hot. Very, very uh, my favorite. I also have a biscuit, American biscuit. We've got some fries as well. I am very thirsty, so I've got the tap water. In here, we've got some um, chicken wings. These are the spicy chicken wings. I'm actually going to try it with one of those because why not? Also, let me get the dips out. Lord have genuine mercy. Did I get, did I give you the mustard thing? Yeah, the mustard dip's really good. Oh, I think maybe they gave you oh. two. So, dip wise, some garlic mayo because I enjoy garlic and mayo. I'm gonna, is that, oh, mac and cheese as well. I forgot I got that. <laughs> By the time I got to that situation, I was genuinely excited. You probably would have seen me. The woman, I was like confused as to why I was so excited about being able to finally order and actually talk to someone. Uh, it felt like I'd gone to heaven, yeah. <laughs> Delirious. Okay, let's let's try a bit of this chicken now. It's really good, I love it. No. Absolutely not. Never ever queue for, thank you so much, thank you. Enjoy. Thank you, never queue for longer than 10 minutes for something. 30 minutes, all right, 30 minutes I'll give it to you. Very spicy though, I'd say, more spicy than you would think. But good, very good. I prefer Popeyes to KFC. It's my favorite, it genu genu genuinely is my favorite chicken branch. I find them a bit crispier than KFC. I'm just laughing at the situation. Regardless, laughing at the situation. I've now had the majority of my wings. I've got one left, it's been very nice, very, very good. Popeyes does spicy chicken phenomenally well but also regular chicken phenomenally well I can't wait to get to the rest of my chicken but here's an ode to the last piece of chicken um, chicken wing let me know if you prefer these chicken wings or the kind of more drumstick like one I prefer these yeah I prefer more tender like yeah the ones where just kind of they fall off the bottle so good <laughs> 
Scone. Do you say yeah, scone, scone or scone? Scone, scone, scone. scone. Comment down below. <laughs> yeah, this is American biscuit. Shop, yeah, yeah, you are. Your hand, this is Vakai's lovely hand in shop. <laughs> <laughs> I've not but tried yeah, my biscuit yet. Yeah. Okay, now let's try the actual pieces of chicken. That's the thigh, I believe, maybe. Maybe it's not a thigh. No, it isn't. The thigh is. It didn't even give me a thigh. Now I'm very upset. I didn't ask for a thigh specifically, to be fair. But it's fine. Thighs are my favorite piece of the chicken. This looks like a thigh, but it's not. It's deceiving. But I'm gonna try it anyway. I just love how crispy it is. Like, look at it. The crispiness. It's definitely not worth, worth an hour and a half of queuing, but it's incredible. Very, very nice. I have to run to work. Bye, guys. Bye, Clark. Thank you so much. Goodbye. I'll see you next Thanks week. Thanks for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> I could have been lunch. Yeah. This is Paris Vlogs coming next week with Makaya. So you'll see you soon. See you later. Bye. So. <laughs> I, it's been an overwhelming day. The queue behind me, as you can see, is probably still there. Um, I'm going to talk a bit about the organization of this whole thing. Obviously, Popeye is only open on Saturday. Today's Tuesday, so it's the first week of it, it being open. I feel like they could have been a bit more organized in terms of like maybe having more stock, maybe having more food, maybe having more staff. To be fair, they had enough, but I mean, they had about three people kind of taking food orders. Maybe more people were working in the kitchen uh, behind the scenes. I don't know. But I feel like the fact that they had one out of bottled water or bottled drinks, only soft drinks, they just didn't have any, as you heard, only fizzy drinks. I don't think that's very good. They'd run out of uh, some of the food items as well, like the onion rings. Again, not a big deal, but I feel like they should have maybe expected this because the marketing for Popeyes has been really, really good. And obviously it's going to be popular for people, you know. It's good. It's very good chicken. In fact, next time I go to Dubai, which hopefully should be soon, I might do a little, I don't know if you want me to, not a mukbang necessarily, but I might show you what the food is like there at the Popeyes in Dubai because obviously that one is easier to get food for because it's not as busy because it's been there for years and years so it's not going to be as um, popular people aren't going to be queuing two hours for it like I did just now this is all the food that's on the table at this moment in time like I said these were the hot wings five pieces of hot wings that I have completely demolished nothing left in there so I can put that in the bag that's empty Rikaya's kind of finished her food obviously she is gone then we've got oh what's this I can't remember oh the chicken sandwich is here the chicken sandwich Popeye chicken sandwich is meant to be phenomenal I've actually never tried it even though I have had Popeye's before I've only ever had the chicken pieces so I'm looking forward to trying that in a bit then there's some mac and cheese and gravy left oh that's just mash and mash and gravy so potato mash and then some gluten-free mac and cheese so we've got all of this to go some more dips as well and then I think that's it so I'm gonna continue eating this first and then get to my burger okay I basically finished the uh, three pieces of chicken as well the regular chicken um, they were good I like both the spicy chicken here and the regular chicken I, th I just think the flavor of the chicken is so nice that doesn't matter if you get it spicy or not but I'm gonna have some of my tap water which I paid for but then they didn't have any bottled water so I just got tap water instead because I am quite thirsty and I don't like fizzy drinks all right okay that's that the fries by the way I've basically eaten most of them but the fries are also very very nice I really like them because they're quite flavorful as you can see so they're Cajun fries I want to say um, they've got a lot of flavor to them they're not just like your basic average fries very very nice I love them I think they're phenomenal some of the best things actually about Popeyes are their fries ironically I am gonna try the biscuit now Rakaya tried this earlier but it basically is a scone or a scone depending on how you say it I guess you're meant to have this with your chicken but I'm just gonna take a bite of its own I mean yeah it's a bit weird especially as somebody who's not American having this a biscuit with your chicken is not something I would do but it's nice it tastes nice this is the mash and Cajun gravy so let me open it this is what it looks like just some mashed potatoes with the gravy on it I'm gonna try some of the biscuits with this maybe I don't know why not yeah I'm not the biggest fan of the gravy actually from Popeyes I remember it now as well that when I tried it in Dubai it was it's been a while since I've tried it to be fair but when I did try it I wasn't the biggest fan of it back uh, the first time I tried it either so yeah not my favorite gravy the mashed potato is good though but I, I'm not the biggest fan of mashed potatoes anyway so I might have to save this for later take it home my brother will probably eat it because he loves food just any food but it is now time for the chicken sandwich which I'm very excited about I'm still kind of okay in terms of how full I am I thought I would be completely full by now but this is the last thing I need to eat as well as this tiny bit of mac and cheese that I also haven't tried yet 
but the chicken burger apparently caused like havoc in America a couple of years ago when they first released it so it's quite a big deal it's literally just a chicken burger like this it's quite plain looking chicken piece bun some mayo in there I can see which is good I like mayo yeah there you go a bit of mayo not even a lot some uh, pickles which I'm not a fan of to be honest not even a lot of mayo I, I was hoping for more mayo where's my mayo at but I'm gonna try it anyway I don't actually have a lot of high expectations for it people apparently like died trying to get this burger over in America when it was first released I don't understand that I mean I say that I literally just spent two hours in a queue for chicken but at least I didn't die I didn't like, kill anyone in the midst of it right let's try this you know what no I am I am disappointed in this burger I don't think the chicken in there is like the best piece of chicken that Popeyes has done the actual pieces of chicken that you can get in a box are better there's a severe lack of mayonnaise just a severe lack of sauce what is this I want more sauce in my um, burger so I'm actually gonna put some of the garlic mayo on it I'm gonna finish it don't worry but I am disappointed I feel like the best thing to get at Popeyes is still just the actual chicken so either the chicken pieces go for a thigh because that's the best one or like the chicken wings that are you can get chicken wings I think are unspicy as well I don't know I'm not sure but the hot wings that are quite spicy to be fair so if you don't like spicy food don't get those but if you like spicy food the hot wings are amazing you can get the actual regular chicken spicy as well if you wish to I've had that before as well tastes amazing but this this chicken burger is definitely not worth the hype in my opinion I love Popeyes I am so excited that we have one now in the UK wouldn't ever queue for it this long again but this chicken burger Burger is not something I'm gonna get again I'm afraid this is what I've got left of my chicken burger it was alright it was an alright burger I've been dipping it into the um, gravy and mashed potato actually to make it taste a little bit better just because I feel like it really 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 lacks mayonnaise and I've just noticed as well it didn't give me any cutlery so I have no idea how I'm gonna eat this last thing that I have here which is the mac and cheese because surely you need cutlery for that and there was no way I'm getting back into that queue just for some cutlery like that whole area behind me I've been in it for long enough it's stressful it's just me as well and like, a lot of people do come to fast food places on their own so I don't really want to leave my table and like go and get something whilst everything is here um, so I don't know how we're gonna eat the mac and cheese we might have to I don't know save it again for later as well but I'm, I'm gonna try and work out something I'm gonna try a method but I'm still gonna finish this first with the mayo and the <laughs> gravy mashed potato thing okay <laughs> not gonna lie I am very very full now but I do want to try some of the gluten-free mac and cheese this is what it looks like so a little bit of underwhelming actually in my opinion I don't think this looks too exciting personally but who knows maybe it will taste nice problem is like I said I don't have any cutlery so might be a bit weird and please don't judge me I've had a weird day weird couple of hours I'm just going to use the lid here to take a little bit like this and then try it from here use this as a spoon basically it's the weirdest thing I've ever done but then today I've done so many weird things that who cheese cheesies decent it's not the best like I guess it doesn't look like incredible either to be fair I don't know I feel like maybe the mac and cheese might be better in America I've never tried Popeyes in America but I feel like um, apparently in the UK they've been using UK ingredients for everything rather than shipping them over from America this is like from Louisiana this is where Popeyes first became a thing they have since branched out to loads of other countries including uh, UAE where Dubai is located and I'm sure other parts of the world as well and now they have one in the UK but yeah they're sourcing all their ingredients from the UK so maybe that's why it tastes a little bit different because America does mac and cheese better than the UK we all know this but yeah this is all that I've got left on the table now so this was uh, the three pieces of chicken that's completely done and dusted and the biscuit and everything that is uh, some of Rakaya's leftover gravy that she tried with her biscuit that's, that's basically all of Rakaya's stuff she's eaten basically all of it she obviously just had to run off to work these are some of the extra dips that I didn't try but I'm gonna take these home with me that's the um, mash and gravy and the mac and cheese which I'm also gonna take home with me so that's that I've got my backpack ready for this and that's basically it that is my meal done now oh I still feel like a bit of an idiot I did not expect the queue to be as long as it was when I entered it obviously otherwise I don't think I would have you probably would have heard me initially being like oh I think this queue's probably gonna be about 20 25 minutes that's fine that would have been I would have been okay with that 
but an hour and 40 minutes was the exact time from the moment I joined the queue until I actually got my food. That's insanity! So if there's one thing you take away from this video, <laughs> don't be me. Do not ever queue this long for anything, unless it's something that is actually worthwhile. I mean, I don't think I'd keep this long for anything in my life. Maybe if it was a Disney character that I really wanted to meet, or a really cool Disney ride, like a new Disney ride that I want to like go on. But definitely not for food, definitely not for chicken. I love Popeyes and I'm happy that it's here in the UK, but yeah, it would, I, <laughs> I mean, one has to laugh. What else can I do at this point? I literally spent two hours in a queue for chicken. That's, that's it. That's something that I chose to do in my life today on the 23rd of November, 2021. I've just left my table, but like, look at the queue. The queue's gone even longer. It goes even further out than it did earlier when I came uh, in to join the queue. This, this is gonna be like a, at least two and a half hour queue, I would say, for the last person in the queue. May the Lord be with them. Well, that is it. Uh, the queue is longer than ever behind me because it actually is about dinner time now. So yeah, it's about quarter to seven. So more and more people would be wanting to get food now. I'm not wearing my mask, by the way, because I'm not close to people at the moment. And the law in the UK says you don't have to wear it. I tend to wear mine whenever I'm near people. So in that queue, obviously I put mine on. But right now in this area, it's not, it's not busy at all. Like, like you can see it's not bad um, I'm gonna put it on again once I get to the underground station but yeah that is the video it's not how I planned it to go I was hoping to buy literally everything and share it with my friend Rukaya but obviously she had to go to work because of how long the queue took um, and then I wasn't gonna obviously buy everything and just try and eat it myself because that would have been a waste of food because I wouldn't have been able to eat everything on my own so yeah I still I still had a good time I still enjoyed eating Popeyes for the first time in a long long time but would I ever recommend you doing something like this ever with any food? No, definitely not. But I do love Popeyes and I'm glad it's in the UK. So if you do come to Westfield in Stratford, check it out if you love chicken. I think it's incredible. I prefer it to KFC. I think I also prefer it to Jollibee's, although I do like Jollibee's. In fact, I do have a video on my channel all about me trying Jollibee's for the first time. So if you want to check that out, if you like food videos, especially like chicken videos, fast food places in the UK, I'll leave that link down below for you. Oh, this is nice. Look at all the lights up there. That's cool. Right. I'm probably going to spend another half an hour so just wandering around Westfield because I've not been here in a long time and then I'm going to go but thank you so much for watching this video I hope you enjoyed it I know I have some American viewers so if any of you have tried Popeyes before because you know Popeyes is a huge deal in America leave your comments down below let me know what your favorite thing is to get do you love the chicken burger because I thought that was quite underwhelming but I love the chicken itself I think the chicken pieces are so so good right I will see you in the next video thank you for watching bye bye